Hi there, I'm Amy. And this is Luca. And this is Luca. And we are going to show you today how to make cabinet toys. Cabinet toys. They look like little dumplings. They do, they look like little fluffy dumplings. <laughs> so you need to start with some fabric. You cut out your fabric into 10 by 10 squares. And you also cut out a, a strip that's 10 inches by like a half inch ish. You're also going to need some cotton batting, just sort of like a handful per toy, and some, some cat catnip. Some catnip, that's right. So we're going to start with the fabric. Luca is going to demo here. <laughs> Laying the fabric down with the pattern side down. Then a little fluff batting. Some fluff is going to go in there, and then catnip. Catnip. Take the lid off. We're going to sprinkle it all over. There you go. Oh, that was a good sprinkle. Okay, let's turn it over so you can get some more sprinkles on this side. Loosen up. Okay. See how loose it was? It was good. That came out really well that time. Okay. What do you think? Is that good? Yeah, that's good. Okay. So then we're going to bring all four corners together. I will hold these first two corners. I'm going to try and keep the bat, the batting sort of squished down. Okay. Okay. Next corner, third corner, fourth corner. You're gonna hold that, and I'm going to grab one? right around the middle. I got this, a thicker one. Okay, yeah, got the strip. I'm gonna wrap it around. I'll turn it around so it's facing the way for you. And tie it in a knot. There we go, tight. Tight! <gasps> All right, some of these fabrics are a little bit thicker. Those ones you want to need to tie, pull extra tight. And we're gonna do a double knot. What? do your cats do when they have catnip? Whether they get sleepy yep. or crazy. Who knows? Thank you.